everyone my name is twinkle and welcome back to my channel today we're going to do a very interesting video um, also let me know if you like the new setup i've just changed uh, angle and a little bit of camera settings so let me know in the comment section anyways coming back to today's video today i'm kind of going to do a very different type of video which i don't usually do on my channel um, but it's never too late to start. So today I'm going to talk about my half yearly favorites. Um, I've seen a lot of YouTubers do that. So, um, and I love watching those videos. So I thought of making uh, my version. So I'm gonna do half yearly favorites. Uh, I'm gonna give my life update and just kind of like a chit chat kind of a video. So without wasting any time, let's just start the video. So these are the things which I have been loving since 2021 started. And these are the things I reach out to the most. Uh, most of them are very inexpensive, very affordable, easily available. Some of them are, but uh, yeah. So uh, let me start by perfumes and deodorants. Uh, my favorite deodorant has been the Live Clean Cool and Fresh deodorant. This is how it looks like and oh my god, this is so good. I have tried so many. I don't know if you watched the empties video or not. Um, I have tried so many but this is the one I reach out to the most. The next two things are this is the mist and this is a perfume so these are the only two i reach out to the most um this i've been using it for past one year and as you can see like it's only 40 percent left i've used the entire bottle it's none other than michael kors um exotic blossom um this is how it is and oh my gosh it smells so 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 good this was my birthday gift last year and i've been loving it since then so yes this is the one i reach out to the most i have one more favorite which i will talk about in a next video so wait for that the mist i am talking about is the bath and body works one in a million mist uh this i bought like two years ago um i don't know why i stopped using it but recently i was like I don't know i i was just missing this fragrance i don't know if that makes sense or not so i was looking for it and i finally found it in my storage and i started using it back again the next products are hair products um this one is a scrunchie it's from arden i bought it like two years ago i have it in so many colors and it's so good it's like a fabric scrunchie it's so good um until you try it you won't know so it comes in a pack of i think three or four for five dollars which is not bad at all for a good scrunchie it's a very good quality you should definitely try it um the second product is um i think i bought it like a few months ago i want to say i don't remember this is like a jock lip i don't know i just call it like clutcher i used to use this in india like back home um, and i own so many of these in so many colors um, this i got it from mini so it's like a nice uh, silver glitter um clutcher it's so pretty the reason why i like big ones is because my hair are so thick and i need something thick big to hold it next category is like a food category um i have few items over here which i would want to talk about and they have been my favorites over a year it's not even like half yearly it's ha it has been in my list over a year so the first one is the vita coco coconut water and this i got it from costco i usually get like a big pack uh, they're very handy you can bring it to work or you can literally bring it anywhere with you um it tastes literally like real coconut water it is i suppose it is a real coconut water but say if you are somewhere where you can't find real coconut water this is the closest you can try the next product is made good bars uh these are the granola bars um it usually comes in like a box and it comes in like six uh, six or eight bars uh, you can find these literally anywhere like you can get it from costco you can get it i think from walmart you can get it at any health food stores even loblos has it um, and i think online too on amazon you can find it it's very good 
um, it's just something um, like say when you, you when you feel like I want to eat something but I don't want to get full uh, but I still want to support my stomach so it's for that it's like on the go bar nothing fancy but it's just it's good it's very good um, and the last food item is actually almond butter cup um, it's very similar to peanut butter cup but instead of peanut it has almond butter um, this is like keto friendly um, I don't mind even if it's not keto friendly but the fact that the chocolate uh, which is like coated outside it's not very sweet and it's not very dark it's somewhere in the middle and that's like the perfect amount of sweetness and darkness that's why I like it. It's very good and it's again something which you can eat it on the go. Next category or the next item is very random. Um, it's something like which I have been using it for over two years I want to say. I know like candles are getting popular on YouTube recently um, but I don't know I never talk about it on my channel uh, but I thought like I should feature my favorite candle so here we are uh, this is the Bath & Body Works Endless Weekend I have like uh, I think a lotion a cream a perfume and a candle of the same variant like that's how much I love it and I feel like this is like my second uh, unit I have finished one of one of this I have so many of the candles like I usually have two around my house one for the upstairs and one for the downstairs um, this is the one which I have been recently loving I also have one more so that's why I couldn't finish a lot but I keep switching between the two but I like this one a little bit better moving on to the skincare I have a few items which has been my favorite and these are the items I reach out for the most the first one is from the earth rose water this is the organic rose water this i got it from an indian supermarket um like a local store over here and it's like a spray bottle it's very good especially in the summers it's like very refreshing so yes and it's very affordable the next one is the belief aqua balm uh, makeup removing cleansing balm it's basically like a makeup removing balm um i have finished it literally like i think only three or four uses are left as you can see it smells so good and it would take like any of the waterproof any stubborn makeup off your face so what i usually do is i would take a little bit of this it comes with a spatula i would take a little bit of this rub it between my palms apply it all over use a microfiber cloth get rid of the get rid of the makeup and then I would use my current favorite um, it has been favorite for almost a year now I want to say um, it's the Nevia Micellar Water uh, it's in the variant dry and sensitive skin which I have so it's that one um, I follow it with this one and then I spritz rose water um, it's so good like this one I have tried so many of the Nevia ones but so far I feel like this is the best and then the third favorite and then the fourth favorite sorry is the garnier green labs uh it's the brightening gel wash it's with vitamin c and pineapple this is the one i usually reach out for it's so good it smells so good and like i keep switching the face washes because like how i am um and i have so many so i have to use them all up but this is the one i've been reaching out lately so hence this is the part of the video okay moving on to the makeup items um i want to talk about eyeshadow like two of the eyeshadows which i reach out for if you have been following me for at least i would say six months you know these are the only two palettes i reach out for like i have so many palettes i did like a vanity tour um if you haven't watched it i'll link it down below go watch it it's a nice fun chill video um but yeah coming back to the palettes like these are the only two which i use the most and reach out to the most i want to say this is the anastasia rivera palette this i got it again i think a year and a half ago i used it 
and then like I stopped using it and then again I started using it again and I constantly reach out for this even if like we're going for like a two-day getaway I'll still carry this if like say if I'm doing someone else's makeup I'll still reach out to this like it's such a versatile palette I mean look at it it's it has like a neutrals colors glitters white dark brown like everything it has everything and like my favorite shade is this one and that one so good and it comes with a brush which i just dropped it it comes with a brush and it says anastasia on it so cool and it comes with a mirror if i didn't already mention the second one is actually a local brand it's the carla cosmetics i have so many products from this brand uh this is the sweet dreams palette so this is how it looks like and i feature this also in my makeup classes if you don't know i do online makeup classes um i can mention the details in the description box or leave a picture here or you can always follow me on instagram to know when are the next makeup classes anyways like this is such a beautiful palette like you get these many glitters you get like neutral shades here and there and then you get like pop of colors a black and this is like a like a white silver glitter i'll just swatch it here it's so good like say if you want to do cut crease or even you can use it as like a like an inner corner highlighter it's so pretty um these are two of my favorite brands for hair care products um, I have so many of the variants, but these are the ones I constantly reach out to or have been my favorites for over six months. So this is the Herbal Essence um, Sulfate-Free Potent Aloe Plus Hemp Frizz, uh, Frizz Control Shampoo. Oh my god, such a long name. But anyways, it's just a Herbal Essence Shampoo, the Frizz Control one, and you can literally find it anywhere and everywhere. I love its fragrance. It's so good all the herbal essence products like so far i've used like five of them like three of the shampoo and two of the other hair care products oh my god i am in love herbal essence if you are watching sponsor this video <laughs> the next product is the l'oreal paris extraordinary oil it's the dry to very dry hair multi-use mask so this product you can use it as like a conditioner as like a mask as like a leave-in conditioner as like a hair cream to like tame your frizz so that's the reason i bought this product i bought it like a year and a half ago um, i started using it and then i stopped using it and then i was like you know what i miss using it so i started using it again anyways it is nourished with jojoba oil it smells so good and you can see how much I have used it. Like just look at the bottle, like it will definitely make it to my next empties video. It's so good. Okay, all the links of the products would be in the description. So don't forget to check the description. There is a lot of info in the description. Um, coming back to makeup, I have literally so much of makeup. I know I said I don't have much makeup. But I mean, what do you expect on this channel? The first thing is what I'm wearing right now. It's again a local brand. It's a Pop of Love Beauty Liquid Lipstick in the shade Charm. Um, if I'm wearing like a pink nude lipstick, 99% of the time it's this one or it's this one mixed with something else because I feel like it goes with any and every makeup. Again, I have showed this on my... Uh, in my makeup classes where I recommend like some some products which no matter what it would work with everything and this is one of a kind um, this is one of them so yeah any look you do even if you do smoky eye even if you do like like a, like a neutral eye or even if you do like a pop of color like right now how I have it or even if you do like plain glitter eyes like plain just glitter or like glossy eyes basically it would go with every look so i either wear this or second favorite um it is from carla cosmetics again it's this lip gloss in the number six it's a nude lip gloss or sometimes i mix these two um i feel like these are the dupe of the fenty lip glosses especially there is one color um it's like a transparent with like hint of pink shimmers so this is how it is and this is how the lipstick is 
um it's this one is like it has so much hint of color but it's still glossy it's very good and it still lasts longer the next makeup favorites are concealers um i'm talking about the l'oreal paris infallible concealer and this is the elf camo hydrating camo concealer i don't know how many times i have featured this product i brought this in january and since then i'm using it i'm like halfway done i need like a backup um and this is the one i recently started using it but it's my favorite i mixed these two and used it on my face today um along with this foundation which has been my favorite since past one year uh, this was also my birthday gift last year it's the estee lauder double wear stay in place makeup uh, that's how it looks like it's so good another favorite is a very affordable one and it has been my favorite for over three years it's the sivana colors ultra blush palette in the 01 variant you can see how much i have used it i have like hit pan in these two shades and oh my god i feel like i use all the colors like all the colors earlier i used to only use that one and when i finished that i stopped using it and then i started using it again and hence it's my favorite today i used this shade mixed with this shade okay so for life update i have two major updates um my schedule is finally fixed so i can focus on a lot of other stuff now i try my best but since it's like a new change i'm still adapting to the change so it will take a little bit longer for me to focus on other things um second update is i got promoted at my work so again as i as i said before that i'm still adapting to the change learning a lot of things and like in my in the back of my mind the work stuff is still there like i still think about it at home i know i need to work on that so yeah those are the two updates um yeah concluding the video by wishing you um all the very best if you have anything important coming up um i wish you good health um and keep watching my videos subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you very soon in my next video bye